Got my DS2 and we are at the beach. I got a sick one here too. I was debating whether or not to go live. You still, there's still a packed beach down there. And um, uh, Jeff's on his way right now. And um, yeah, three signals. Uh, this is the third of which. First two were quarters also, so tested the ground a little bit. We might have some room to operate. And uh, yeah, if nothing else, it's a beautiful night. And uh, we're gonna be getting our steps in. Anything that we get is a bonus, of course. But as people are trickling in, let me say hi. I haven't done that. I actually looked at uh, some of my last few streams. I haven't done this in a while. So if anybody wants to say hi, comments, you know, stuff like that, let me take the headphones off for a second. Go, go, go. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. What's up? Red. Bluetooth, what's up? Nicholas, Michael, what's up? I appreciate you guys, thank you. 22 in the house, I'm sure you're not here to see my face, you're here to see what comes out of the ground, but I just wanted to say hello and thank you because I haven't done that in a long time. Greetings from New York, J-Zone John, what's up? David Frazier, what's up? Get that treasure, Detective Steve, I hear ya. Vic, what's up? First time here, welcome. I find metal, welcome. Gold Sea Outdoors, welcome. Howdy. Silver Wrench, what's up? Yeah, it's been, uh, I was actually out this morning. I finished the video this morning. Um, the summer, you know, I'm a teacher, so uh, I could do two days. Uh, I don't have uh, work in the morning until uh, September I do, but uh, yeah. What's up, Mark East? How you been, buddy? PR4470, what's up? <laughs> I was watching Jackass forever, but I, oh man, that, that's that's gonna be uh, tough to live up to. I, I, that was a funny movie from what I've heard. Florida Sand Hunters, what's up? Don Hine, what's up? Thanks, John, appreciate that. Yeah, I just wanted to uh, say hi, hey really quickly. I'm gonna try to do this periodically over the course of the video. We have a signal right here. I've dug two signals so far. We've got, we still have a beach that's full of people. And we are, we have a signal here somewhere. Doug, um, I dug two quarters so far. So tested this. Should be good to go. Got that. Hold on. Let me get this fastened. I do believe it's go time. All right, don't lose your headphones, Meryl. Is that something you would do? Got them. And we're going to start out with the signal. You know, I like to do a little outing before we go live. Because the last thing I want is a Dub Beach. Yes, we got one here. Let me get my pinpointer. And we're ready to go. All right, 95, this should be a quarter. Jeff's on his way. Gives us double the chance of finding treasure. I've hit a hot streak recently. I got some videos coming out. It's been a, a hot streak, so uh, summer is uh, upon us, and we are digging. We got a quarter, so that's uh, 75 cents. It's the first, you know, obviously since the stream started, but you know, walked around. There seems to be signals here, and if there's uh, quarters in the ground, uh, I question. Uh, there's a lot of detectorists in New York. I mean, uh, we're, we're very efficient, so the fact that there's quarters still here is perhaps a good sign. Let's spiral out from this. And I'll show you some of the erosion. We got some erosion going on. A little bit of a uh, cliff we got here, beach cut.
I tell you what, this is going to be an iron signal. I'm digging this, though. I've had earrings ring up just like that. No, I don't think that's going to be an earring. Where'd it go? Well, we're not going to spend too much time at an iron signal. Let's try one more time. Go over it. Yeah, spend way too much time in this, Merrill. You know that this is going to be... Well, I'll tell you what. It's a small piece of iron. We'll just pull it that. Let's move on while we got daylight. I do have my headlamp. Oh, we got another detectorist and we got Jeff on the way. So. In fact, I see Jeff. Yeah, Jeff's on his way. Let's walk in this direction. Forty-six in the house. Yeah, the beach cleanup crew has arrived. That would be me. Skip that. Looks like Jeff's got a signal. He's in the middle of people. I always feel bad in uh, live streams. Yeah. I should just say forget about it. It's about two hours until low tide. iron too. Wait, why am I digging it then? Don't dig it, Meryl. Think, man. You gotta think. New York uh, still has the lifeguards on duty. When I went to Florida, there were no lifeguards. give you a view of the beach. There's people the other way. And what I'm going to really try to do, you know, I was looking at my last few streams, I don't know, every 20 minutes or so, unless we're in the middle of a patch, I'm going to try to uh, come on, answer questions. Big iron. Beach is, you know, moderately sloping. It's interesting. Oh. 
there has been um, a change in my thought process in terms of pushing. I still do believe in it, but what I'll value more than a patch from pushing, which does happen, is a low beach. And that's very conventional wisdom. Uh, I've been reading a lot of books lately. And I put mine out. If you go to my website, Merrill's Guide to uh, Finding Rings on the Beach is in the shop. My website is iratemetaldetectors.com. Just saying you could also pick up a heck of a sand scoop. I'm using the first prototype right now. The current prototype is uh, in the shop as they're making it. Oh, here we go. That's an excellent signal right here. So let's put this down. Seventy seventy one. Usually you see it by now if it's a ring. Just like the Equinox, little, little piece of something. On to the next, go. On any weekend uh, beach day where the weather is nice, you just gotta be at the right place at the right time. I'm telling you, there's so much to just showing up. The, the more that you show up and accept that sometimes you're gonna fail, the better off that you're gonna do. All right, I'm not doing much V shapes. I still believe in those V shapes. the other way if this goes dead but I, I've known um, I've known patches to jump up so we're gonna move fast we can always head back I brought my headlamp I plan on being here for a while and sometimes it is just uh, honey badgering it just persistence I hate to say fight to the death, but you know, <laughs> the beach metal detecting. Swing till, uh, swing till the ring. Some of you may think I'm going too fast. Personally, I don't think I'm going to beach. When I found those targets, I spiraled out from them. I didn't see anything connected to them. They were sporadic. Might have heard something there. What I am looking for is uh, cuts down the beach. You know, like what has really pushed in down the beach. And uh, that's what I'm, you know, looking for, keeping my eye out for. And 
I might be too low on the beach too. Then again, this is where targets come in. <laughs> Want me to ground balance? I just glanced at the screen. Let's do that. Another two minutes goes by. We're still getting nothing. I'll do a uh, quick high. Nice thing about this detector is you can go high up on the beach and where there once was cuts you can get down to it. But we're very efficient I mean, with the current bunch of detectorists, all of us, you know, Sweet Equinoxes, Legends, Days 2. This is gonna be a big piece of iron. That's what this is gonna be. Yep, I can feel it. away from the volume area of the beach. I'm kind of kicking myself right now. It's the family thing, you know, but there's a bunch of kids swimming and, you know, I don't want to, uh, you know, there's a lot of crazies out there in the world. I don't want parents like saying, who's this dude with the camera? This might be another, but we're going to another volume area of the beach. Sounds like iron. What in the world? Maybe part of the night. Oh, can opener, that's what it is. We got a can opener. There we go. 
How about that? What a treasure. All right, let me say hi. I'll tell you what, I'm strapped in pretty good. Let me answer questions. Digging turtles in the house. What's up, buddy? I find metal. Donald Hale, Ralph Patrick. Thanks, Ralph Patrick. Right on. I'm going for that sushi, a guitar. I'm trying. Showing up is the, uh, <laughs> even when it's like this. I, I hit three signals tonight, I got 75 cents. But, let me show you. There's another volume part of the beach. And perhaps an area where it is pushing in a little bit. That's where we're heading. Oops. here too. steps today I went this morning interesting we got a rock in the middle of the beach I don't see any others but maybe we're finding a section that it's a little bit lower Thanks, Pat. <laughs> Entrances and exits. Are one of the keys. You gotta go where the volume is. Can it go down the beach? Absolutely. I saw get in the water. You know, we can go a little bit more in the water, but I'm telling you, New York, we got a little bit crazier waves. And when I was in Florida, I was in Florida the whole time. And it just, it moves. I've done ring recoveries where I've had to be in the water. We got waves that stuff will just... it comes up on the beach. 
it sinks down there. Lovely. I did scout this place. I got three quarters. One of which I took. Somebody just gave me more than I just found. It's a pity. Let me check that. I saw a message. After two years, I finally found my third gold ring uh, to wear number 10, uh, 10.6 grams of 14K. Thank you, Merrill. A lot of it's because of you, Michael. Thank you so much, man. You just made my day. Especially on a, uh, at a moment where it's like, you know, not happening. But I'm telling you, we, we all know there's no guarantees in metal detecting. Uh oh. Somebody's like, I told you so. Get in the water. Okay. for the water now. Let's do it, man. Honestly, this is why you get a honey badger. water signals. This you can't filter. Um, you know, the, uh, if, the, if it was a silky beach, yes you could. This is very rocky. big, whatever it is. I feel it. Something huge. I think it's gonna be one of those fence posts.
power line and I go, you guys say something nice about me, all right? Or at least hit that like button. <laughs> Hey, good call. Who said water? We just got a phone. How about that? This is a tough little phone. Let's see what we got. I seriously doubt this is going to turn on. It's an iPhone, yeah. That's the Honey Badger. This is Honey Badger 1 though. Honey Badger 2 is in the, uh, it's in the shop right now because they are replicating it. So we have the aluminum bar. We are not selling aluminum bars. This is the temporary solution that we had. And uh, you know, you got carbon fiber shaft. Uh, basically this was the one with the wobble and uh, has a slight give. We want no give whatsoever on it. So Jeff created the plate mechanism that uh, worked a heck of a lot better. All right, we're on the board. I'm, this is gonna like really confuse me though because I'm gonna reach a phone tonight and I'm gonna be freaking out like my phone did not turn on, what the heck? I have no extra phones. What, what should it be? Oh, snap. I guess he's wrong. Merrill's wrong. Yeah, get in the water. Okay, let's get in the water. Let's secure everything. We got a 62 in the water. All right, so you might think that this is a little bit too loud. Let's do Beach Peak. I had a 62 here.
Whenever I dig here, I try to stick my foot. Ah, that's my underwear. Great. something to dig though. excited about the phone. Not excited about the state of my underwear right now. That might be too much information for some, but... Give you a view of the beach until Beach P is a lot more stable. When you are underwater, you gotta have the uh, wire connected though. Otherwise, Beach P stands for Beach Pointless. Oh, that's a good one. Dad joke right there. I'm telling you, summer is just getting started. Summer season, uh, it's detecting season. I mean, I'll tell you this, uh, it, it's in my book too, uh, that I just released that's on my website. Um, the summer, really, it, it starts in, in late, you know, late August, as soon as, uh, as soon as the tides really start pushing in and the beach goes lower that's when it really starts. I've been hitting the push-in patches, but, you know, we don't have a low beach yet. All right, back to beach sensitive. When I'm out of the water, beach sensitive, you can use that in the water. It's just gonna be really, uh, loud. Shatter. There we go. I like this signal. Take a look at this. Yeah, it helps if you see the screen. This is not gonna be zinc. 86, which is the top of zinc. But I saw it go a little bit higher. Let's try to make short work of this. One more scoop.
Got it. I see it. Yep. Eighty-six. There we go. See, you just gotta keep walking and get in the line. No. Let's make short work of this. Honeybee goes deep. Got it. Don't got it. Wah, wah, wah. The phone, by the way, rang up at 88. iPhone. Might have it. Alright, we're hitting something now. What in the world is this? Yep, more can slow. How are ya? Whatever it is, that sounded really, really, really good. If it's good, you usually see it by now. Are you serious? 46? One of these. Really? At least we're on the coin. No, that's not a coin. What am I talking about? Zinkins are... No, no, no.
got a double signal here. Go, go, go. I think it's deeper than this. Sure is. This is my sand mover. Now it sounded like iron. Yep, that's iron. Whatever it is, let's get this off the beach. We never have to worry about it again. have a rope here. That's metal. I'm prepared to dig tonight, man. I'm prepared to dig. We already got something nice. I dig everything, but these are iron. You can hear it by the, the cutoff signal. And also the target ID verified that. Ferris Crump, what's up? Henry, what's up? Oh. That's a big piece of iron right there. The fact that we're getting low iron on the beach, though. Put this strip down more than usual. Seventy-three. That's a good one. You could get gold at that number. I think it's going to be a little deeper than this. I'm hitting a hard surface. Not my phone. We're recording with my phone. We got 
this. Got my pinpointer. Junk! It's heavy though. opening up a bit. that for uh, 73. Get you a better view. What's up, Team Lynch? was about the Warriors. The commute that they did, that was my exact commute. Now it's over. <laughs> A lot of iron. Should 
be a quarter. But you know what metal detection surprises? surprise us? may not be. Hello. This is probably a quarter. I think so. I'm working on it. Oh, sure. It's, it's happened before, absolutely. Yeah, it's a fun way to get exercise. We don't have to pay tuition, right? What do you mean? Oh, right. Actually, I'm YouTubing. I'm teaching uh, on YouTube right now. <laughs> Yes, the question is free. <laughs> uh, next time, bring one more. I help you dig. You got it, my friend. You got it. Absolutely. <laughs> oh, we got it. We got it. Let's see what we get. Oh, I see it. It is a piece of scrap metal. <laughs> Wasn't even a coin. But, oh, well, we'll, we'll, we'll recycle that. Yep. Nice All right. Have a good night. All right. Yeah. Uh, you got a you got a forty uh, fingers crossed. Thing. Thank you. Thank you, my friend. <laughs> said tuition. I thought he was messing with me. I was like, what? I'm like, no, I'm not taking tuition. <laughs> but no, that was, they were very nice. And I try to be good ambassador for metal detecting, whatever, you know. I want to be do level. Keith, what's up, buddy? I miss you, brother. How are you? Speaking of being ambassador, I'm going to run out of sand before I fill this. <laughs> so that's the best that I could do. The water's going to fix the rest. Somebody's going to yell at me in the video, but so be it. I tell you what though, when you get on top of pipes like that, that's the sign of a low beach. Remember my videos with the uh, birds? This is the bird section. So I question if both detectorists and uh, people have been here. thickens. Look at that. Do you see what that is? Of course it's just George. It's Green George. Lou is in Staten Island. We hung out a few weeks ago. We gotta hang out again. He's been super busy. Um, he works for Con Ed and New York is going through a heat wave right now. He's keeping New York cool and he's been wanting to detect but you got to check him out he's blowing up on tiktok so look for indiana Jones on tiktok youtube does not push out metal detecting videos so we must him on youtube but uh go say hi on tiktok and i think he's still planning on doing something with the youtube all right so that was good we saw a green quarter there that has been in there for a while this detector is famous for pulling deep gold rings. And it's happened to me a bunch of times. Sorry, Mark! I'm doing my best. Yes, sir, Mark. Channel member, I gotta listen to. <laughs> I think you're giving me a hard time, though. I've been trying to...
And you changed your name to Barry. Very clever. Very clever, Mark. Very clever. Uh oh, what's up? That's what I'm talking about right here. Go to Midtone. You gotta dig them every time. They will break your heart 99 out of 100 times. So you gotta dig them every time. Go, go. That sounds good. What are you? What are you? Watch you be a zinkin. Usually if it's gold, you see it by now. All right, we're getting old, old metal. Yeah, we're getting old too, but we're getting old metal. Here we go. Solid 81, which is probably zinc, but I have gotten so many rings on zinc signals. No one else digs them. Deus mixed everything sound service. Come on, man. Try to push it to the side. Or made it sink a little bit more. got it this time. Got it. Does not sound round. Round, but it's tiny. Oh, it's the, uh, is it the end of a bullet? I don't know. On to the next. Tell me that doesn't sound good. I'm telling you, 99 times out of 100, it's going to break your heart. But that 100th time, oh, it keeps you coming back. Now it doesn't sound good. Actually, now it does. What the fluff muffin is this? Come on, man. Ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah, Honey Badger Scoop is available on iRateMetalDetectors.com. I'm super proud of it. I'm 
in all honesty, super proud. It's the best scoop I've ever used, hands down. It should be, I mean, it's designed, at least iteration one is exactly what I would want uh, in a scoop. You know, I get it. This is, uh, you know, this might be too big, you know, uh, for its preference. And we're making a smaller version uh, right now. But, uh, you know, this is right. <laughs> so thanks, Team Lynch, uh, for the super chat and also uh, for letting me <laughs> do my sound bite there. saying it's valuable but this is a low beach right now stuff is pushed in stuff has moved around and i don't think it's been detected the birds have been protecting it other signals. Check out the beautiful sunset. We've got a beautiful sunset going on. You know, we've got health. Um, you know, I'm thankful. What can I say? Um, <laughs> even if things, uh, you know, little things don't work out, you gotta just keep positive. And this definitely helps helps keep the spirit up. So, uh, you know, I'm thankful. Thank you guys for tuning in. By this guy. I just got bit by a crab. I kid you not. Where are you? There he is. You're trying to escape again. He bit me. This jerk bit me. I'm not putting my finger there. Okay, this is what we do. We're not going to hurt him. This guy. Oops. Yeah, you're going towards my toe again. Let's let you be. He seriously had his pinchers on me. He's staring at me. That's what my dogs do. What the birds do? Everything's been attacking me. I was just saying about how everything's peaceful. What's up, Mr. Tones? Everybody misses you, Mr. Tones. I'm having to stare down. You want to pinch the days? Here's your pinchers. Hey, 
leave me alone, monster. Okay. I'll leave you alone. Have a nice day. He was like up under my sand. Here, let's get you back in the water. You should be moving now. There you go. Go move. Go surfing the tides. You little jerk. Don't fight me again. I've never been bitten in a live stream. That was kind of a... Uh, No idea. They're they're in the bird zone. They're about to get died. Look at this. See them swarming? They're about to get dive bombed. Get out of there. Are you crazy? Then again, I just walked through there. Oh, hey, what's up, Brooklyn treasure hunter? All right, let's get some treasure and let's not be bit by crabs. He just went for me. Jerks. that long sound I'm calling that this is not a coin yeah this is gonna be another signal that we're gonna go to war with like that phone but at least I have the honey badger In mind this is honey badger one uh, I mean the scoop itself is like very similar design I've got the aluminum bar on this one it is a temporary measure this could be another phone Got under it. I see iron. Let's try getting under it one more time. Good. Either that or we 
pulled up a coral reef. Captured by the honey badger. What in the world is this? Okay, this is not fitting in my bag, folks. Just saying. So we're gonna have to throw this one deep. So that's what we're gonna do. Let's do this here for a second. I got all the other stuff. That's just not gonna fit. <laughs> Coming in great. I'm happiest about the, the phone, but that green quarter got me the most excited. And we got plenty of heavies with this. All right, we got it. You see, I saw the ring, and bummer. Nickel shouldn't be allowed to ring up like that. Okay. Headlamp time. Go, go, go. Yeah, this is one of those I need to dig nights. Everything's good, everything's happy, but man, sometimes you just need to dig. Right? wire tucked back in because this detector is so sensitive this was out you know that's for my uh, booster that should be pretty close to surface Cool. Whoa. What the what? Okay. Which is a gear to the doomsday clock. No, not really.
Oh yeah, fishing reel. Good thinking. It's not the doomsday clock. Come on, Merrill. Iron. Isn't it ironic? We haven't really tried high on the beach, so let's go a little bit higher with the one of the bees. See? See, it enabled us to get another piece of iron. If anybody's new here, please consider hitting that subscribe button. We have fun here. Can't promise you every time we go out, we'll find something great nobody can. I mean, there's a channel called X Finds where they completely fake metal detecting, but... Let me not hate. Try a little bit more in the water. That's a good signal right here. Sixty six, that is. Got it. What in the world? Oh, I see it. This troublemaker. Nah. And we got some sea fleas. No seagulls out. You know, sometimes I don't know if I'm on Team Seagull or Team Sea Flea. What team are you guys on? Team Sea Flea or Team Seagull? Like, you know, when you're detecting the beach, you accidentally dig them up and you're like, help! But then again, the birds have to eat too. Maybe you're on team detectors. In other words, there's a gold ring in the way. <laughs> the birds and the uh, uh, sea fleas are in trouble. There's no shortage of good signal. That's a 53. I know we're not getting a lot of coins. Listen, man, coins are like your first year metal detector. Well, I mean, 
you know, old coins, it's different. Great for a second. Junk. Thank you for the 109 likes. If you're joining us late, I'll show you the highlight. Yeah, that's what we found. Old phone. Say what? But I do think there can be more. Sometimes you could just feel it, like the uh, knock on wood. We haven't had any issues with this stream. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes that, let me shut up right now so that that doesn't start. There we go. 93. Well, signals are close to the water. Although we've spent most of our time down by the water. and deep. I don't think we have it, but let's give this a dump. No, we don't. That, that's where you want the honey badger scoop. Just saying. All right, what we got? Why, it's a quarter. I was more excited with the green one. Yeah, that wave caught me. That was whack. Yeah. You nobody got time for that. Didn't I say I was going to do like, uh, I'd say hi every few minutes? Darn it, Meryl. Yeah, tides are coming in most 
definitely. Ooh, 65. This is the crowded area of the beach. Watch this be a pull tab. I have a feeling it's a pull tab. 65 is a very popular number for pull tabs. On the dais, at least. And one, uh, one on the uh, new cans, you know. That shouldn't be pulled off. You got it. Did Merrill call it or what? Oh, I called it. Yep. Sixty five. Nah. Nah. Got signals, that's all we can ask for. I mean, we can ask for nice stuff, but I'm good. Kind of an odd number. It's in. I mean, you could get a penny at that, an old one. First high up signal. High up the beach, that is. It's a dimmy. All right, let's look around here a little bit. Spiral, spiral, spiral. I have a feeling there's going to be more. Teenagers who are staying late at the beach are looking at me in horror like, oh my god, this is going to be me someday. Yes, it is. <laughs> Although our generation will have uh, taken up all the gold by then. I'll leave him some silver. They'll be dropping like bitcoins in the metaverse <laughs> and metal detecting that. If any of you don't know what the, the metaverse is, you want to Google it. Just saying. It's going to make Facebook cool again. I thought I stepped on another crab. 
it was seaweed. Yeah, I just jumped off it quickly there. Oops. Please think. about that. Now, that, that's, uh, I usually get pretty excited about, but you could tell that one was a, uh, a new drop. Having that said, uh, detectorists would have probably found that. I think we're the first ones coming through in a while. That one could have been a good signal, but at this, with the waves as they are, even with the HBS, honey badger scoop, that would have been, that would have taken us half an hour. Beautiful night. Hey, thanks for the 121 likes. Jeez, I didn't even notice. I'm sorry. Thank you very much. Somebody from YouTube contacted me and said that I should consider making rest videos. In other words, me not talking, that's very tough. Um, and just the waves and the detective. So peaceful. Maybe I'll use a Bob Ross voice. Happy little trees. Back.
I see a little structure to the beach up there. Let's go back a little bit. I have a feeling there's gonna be some signals back here. was once a cut that filled in. Let's give you a nice view of the sunset while I ponder life and swing my coil. I'm gonna move a bit. Here we go. Because I was gonna say we've lost. Um, where the majority of signals are. 93. Hear the screaming? Think somebody get attacked by birds? Wouldn't be shocked. We are spiraling. What if we find a ring? The tradition is we go to Taco Bell together. I wouldn't call this slim pickings. Um, it's a quiet beach, I suppose, but.
the day is beeps when you're when you are over <laughs> a good target it wakes you up going on two hours, huh? Normally, if I stay high like this, I'm sorry, I stay low like this going down the beach. I go back up the beach high, if that makes sense. I'm not talking about substances, no. I'm talking about latitudes. I'm talking about being higher up on the beach. We got a jetty up here. I think we're gonna stop about there and head back a little bit. Let me actually stop and talk to people though. I've been horrible. Like I've looked at the last few live streams for a bit and other than the technical difficulties which we are not having tonight, I'm like, man, I wish we could do something about that. So I'm gonna stop and talk Ooh. Got some sloping going on here. Darn ADHD. You could also try the dry, but the cool kids stay in the wet. There's structure to the wet, you know? In the dry, it's just like. Dig everything, see what you get. All right, Merle, shut up and yeah, keep saying you're gonna answer questions. Okay, there we go. Let me take this phone down and switch. Wait, that didn't work. I'm like super illuminated. That's like too much illumination. Too much illumination scares people. All right, that's probably good. All right, phone loose. Let me say hi. What's up? Hi. Thank you for the uh, 129 likes. That's insane, yo. That's insane. We'd also like to know what Mind Lab will come up with. I would too. Um, I heard, I can't really, I can't um, in terms of the source. But a very reliable source who has told me correct information in the past has told me that uh, within the next six months, Mind Lab will be coming out with something big. Now you gotta remember, we're in the middle of the supply chain, you know nonsense mess you know that's still going on you know we're recovering from all of that so it could be that uh you know they're a little bit late with that but according to this person within the next six months that's what uh we're gonna have another detector color screen that would be nice yeah bradley what's up how long are you detecting tonight uh, it's kind of a quiet beach. I'm going to try going uh, down the beach high again, um, but I don't think that there's going to be much. Um, we, we, we got a phone. I'm happy with that. That's cool. Pat Orange, thanks for everything, Merrill. Great job. Thank you so much. Some beach detecting. I'll pay more money uh, for it 
as long as it's perfectly waterproof. Yeah, right? Like if they draw an actual waterproof version of uh, the Equinox. I'm telling you, I, I said this in the last video with the Deus. There's not too much difference between the Deus and at least the 15 inch coil with the Knox. That can match. That, that can definitely match. There's some people that say otherwise it goes deeper. No, I've read the manual, you know, the, the salt sensitivity uh, and um, uh, what should we call it? Reactivity, which is the um, equivalent of uh, recovery speed. You know, basically you turn those down um, and they turn the salt sensitivity up, that's as deep as the detector is going to go. Um, you know, it, it's very similar, but I, I'll say this with the caveat that a 11 inch coil can match, actually no, can exceed what the Mine Lab um, 15 inch coil can do. So, anyway, hi cat, how are you? History in the hall, what's up? Gonna have sushi tonight. Let's show you what we got tonight. Really, it was one thing. There was a few other interesting ones. We got an iPhone tonight. <laughs> so, uh, th that's about it. You know, metal detecting, you know how it goes. On the beach, it was, mm, it was so-so. Um, I think it was iDig Metal that suggested, uh, like, hey, go in the water. I went right in the water and I got that and it, it's very tough. New York, uh, we have like the moving water. When I was in Florida, the entire trip, I was in the water. I am a believer, you know, go in the water, but um, New York, yeah, it, it moves. Oh my goodness, we have a, a, a new uh, channel supporter, uh, Mike Mahoney. Thank you so much uh, for your channel membership. Truly, truly appreciate you. Thank you. Adele, what are you doing here? You're a monster, Adele. <laughs> hey, Adele, what you doing this weekend? Good job, I can handle you. You're responsible for the one uh, good find in this video, so thank you for that. John! Um, John Cur Curiali, my eyes are horrible. Thank you so much. I truly appreciate your uh, patronage. Um, I I'm uh, going to reinvest that. I'm going to be picking up another legend. Uh, you might know that I sent mine down to uh, Florida. So I, I need to uh, repurchase that. So uh, thank you for the help with that. Um, any luck? Uh, tonight we got uh, a phone. So... Yeah. Ken, how you feeling? Good, glad you're okay. I see I see your message there. I find metal, thank you for the uh, support with this and the suggestion there, that was great. Oh, Mike Mahoney, I taught for 43 years. What do you teach? I have taught, I've been both a administrator and a teacher. Uh, I'm back to teaching right now. Right now I'm currently teaching business. And uh, I teach marketing, and I teach some classes on uh, Microsoft Word, Microsoft uh, Excel. I was a director of data for a while, and I get to teach uh, a lot of that uh, to the kids. Uh, marketing, I'm excited about fundamentals of business. I'm really excited about. Started my career as an art teacher, and I taught uh, special ed and social studies also. The birds are going crazy. Yeah, they want to dive bomb me. That's what they do. They've been single-handedly keeping people off this beach over the summer. They're jerks. Why would they do that? That's horrible. Ah. Yeah, the birds are going crazy. <laughs> uh, Johan Lindemann, I love Adele. Everybody loves Adele. I'm going upstate to get... Oh, you're not going to be around. I promised you this week that we'd go to Dead Horse Bay. Oh, geez. Okay, yeah, we gotta go Dead Horse Bay. Adele. This is your fault, Adele. All your fault. Yep. Sea chicken, it's what for dinner. I didn't even have my dinner yet. I'm kinda hungry. I kinda wish I got a wing, but 
I'll give you um, a, a hint. This morning I did, I got two. Uh, neither one of them were quite spectacular, but uh, I, I did reserve the right for Taco Bell. You know, per the <laughs> silly unlocks we have on the channel here. So, which is good. Must be the honey badger. Interesting. Yeah, I, I just wanted to, uh, you know, thank everybody. Uh, I really, I was looking at the last few live streams and, uh, you know, it, it, the fact that I'm like talking my head off now and we still have over a hundred people in here, I appreciate it. <laughs> so, even though it didn't work out tonight, I do have a new book out. If you go to my website, iratemetaldetectors.com, and you go to the shop, I wrote a book on how to find rings at the beach. That didn't work tonight. It doesn't mean that you're going to find it every time that you go to the beach, but um, it's my methods. Um, I'm pretty proud of that book, so it's there. Thanks, Ralph. Thank you so much. When people next to you start to feed the sea chickens, it's like they get the umbrella. Yep. Trev Serves, what's up? Hello from England, so cool. Phone unlocks ice cream, that sounds good. That sounds good. I've been cutting back a little bit, it's not fun. I actually, I, I kept, uh, it just in the recent video, I kept some of the unlocks out. But, uh, you know, Basically, um, you got to start to watch your lifestyle after a while. <laughs> so that, that, that's what I'm trying to get my steps in and be healthy. The more healthy I am, the longer I can detect. What's up, Andrew? How are you? Yeah, but basically, um, I came on here. I wanted to say thank you and. Hold on. Cousin of Slop. You see, I just stared into this light and I have like this big circle in the middle of my field of vision right now. Um, let's see. Hello from Detroit, Michigan. Enjoy your videos. Thank you so much. <laughs> I, Ed says, I liked unlocking the can of cherry pie filling. I love that stuff. That stuff is uh, legendary. I, I think we should keep that as the uh, button unlock. It, it will unlock everybody's buttons if you do that stuff. Yeah. And weren't we just talking about cutting back? Um, the only way I missed these live streams, um, I was out detecting myself right on some beach detecting. Thanks for all of the support uh, for a long period of time. Uh, Clint Fox, what's up? Oh, thank you so much. Uh, congrats on the Florida home purchase. My wife and I uh, just may rent it for one week. That's awesome. Great idea leaving a detector there uh, for the renters. Not only that, I probably didn't do a good, a good enough job saying. Um, like I intend to become an expert on the legend. I have to repurchase it, but I will help you get set up with the legend, you know, tips and all that. Um, I want to make it fun. You know, that's what it's all about. I, I sure got skunked when I got, you know, when I went to Florida. <laughs> Um, it's a beautiful place to detect. Oh, Sanibel Beach. Oh, that's one of my favorite places, regardless of what I get. Uh, Hummy Hero, hello from Tennessee. <laughs> Watch out for the gangster. Oh my God, I literally got pinched by one. Thankfully, he wasn't very strong. Healthy shake than berries and stuff, yep. Yep, that's what I gotta, that's how I gotta think. But when you get your steps in, it definitely helps. Yeah, I'm gonna try to do like maybe two live streams, three live streams a month. And uh, I did check the beach first. I got uh, two quarters and I got a third one. I'd like for the beach to be a little bit more filled. Um, you know, it's an honor that we still have a hundred people here just listening to me. So uh, I'm humbled and I'm thankful. Yeah, I really, really am. 
thank you is the uh, the big you know words I really want to get out tonight. So, all right, let's do a little bit more swinging. You never know what you're gonna get. Um, I'm heading back to the car, but the tides are nearly coming in. I've got my headlamp. Let's put that back on. And let's go. You never know what you're going to get. If you get a ring, we're going to Taco Bell together. Beep. Beep. Oh, these old bones, man. I'm 43 right now. I'm telling you. I was telling somebody... Look at this, how crazy is this? There's a big difference between um, 33 and 43, even 38, you know, and uh, 43. That's when it really starts to uh, start to feel it. But anywho, we're getting our steps in. So we did the low approach before. Now we're gonna do some V shapes up on the high. There is some structure to the beach, meaning that there's a slope. There's what looks like, um, you know, cuts down the beach. not sanded and when up high is just there's nothing that tells me that somebody has been up uh, up high at least Anybody gritting this beach is out of their mind. Uh-oh. There we go. Very good signal right here. 50. Come on. Cap of bottle mask. I heard the skip after it came out.
on to the next. Beautiful reflection going on. Look at that, we got the moon up in the sky. On the water. You gotta notice stuff like that and just live. I'm in a much better place this year than I was last year. Um, that, you know, I don't know how long some of you have been following this channel, but for 20 years I had a commute that was like, <laughs> four to five hours per day and uh, you know in I worked in charter which was not the most stable environment uh, but I gave that up I had a leadership position in the charter school gave that up for um, oh, for a teaching position that's a lot closer and last year there was some uh, family drama you know, not anybody that I live with, but, uh, you know, family drama. Um, it's gotten better. Everything's gotten better. So, feels good. And I tell you, man, night detecting, it, it's my favorite. It really is my favorite. Like, just look, look at the scenery around. It's just, this is heavenly. One of the most important tips is going to sound so ridiculously simple. Make sure that your swing does not leave the ground. It's not rocket science. I know some of you are getting upset that I'm not overlapping my swings. No, you don't do that on the beach, I don't think. You do that once you find stuff, when you know you're in a patch. Like, the difference is... I find something, okay, you always see me spiraling out, verifying if it's alone or if it is, you know, within something else. And I, I kind of do my best hunting when I get to patches. That's when I grid. Anybody who walks onto a beach and is just like gridding makes no sense. Seems to be waking up a little bit. The beach, not the birds. The jerks are always awake. Interesting. Here's the
I think it's iron. I was gonna say, let's see what the dais can do, but I'm almost positive that's iron. I mean, you've seen what the dais can do. You maybe have like an inch, inch and a half on the Equinox. Iron. That is not iron. Sixty. It's a fantastic signal. This ain't over. On the nickel and it's green let's look around here we're not done it was maybe about nine inches down here's where you see me go slow Big of a patch, I don't know. See, I got lazy on my V-shapes on the way down. And I tell you, even though I've done a million live streams, you get anxious about, you know, you want to get good stuff. Right, another greenie right here. Although this has not been in as long as that nickel. Here's where we say, let's see what the dais can do. And let's see what the honey badger can do. Not as clear.
Oh yeah. Wait, what the heck just happened? I just had a loud signal. Oh, here we go. What the heck is this? It's a bird ring. No, it's a bullet. <laughs> All right, it wasn't super deep, but it was small. That was a good, uh, you know, 10, 11 inches down. And that's impressive for a small target like that. Oh, we're in a patch, folks. Sounds good. Think we got it. What is this? We've been pulling old stuff all night. Old is not the problem. Something's keeping me here, I'm telling you. This is old stuff. Mother of Pearl. Junk. I think that one came from my bag. I remember pulling that before.
28. You don't usually get aluminum foil this low on the beach. Granted, it's New York. Got it. Grape ice, probably like a vaping flavor. Nah. Cheesy name. Oh, let's fall for another low tone, 38. Well, it's ring shaped. Definitely hit a patch. I missed this on the way down because I was too low. Got it. Zinc one. 153 likes, thank you. Nothing else we try hard. I'm telling you, part of success, biggest part is showing up.
Isn't it ironic? Oops, sorry about that. Holy crap, look at this, it's a baby shark. We got a baby shark here. And he's still alive and we're gonna get him back in the water so he could bite people. Hey, I see you moving there. Yeah, I'm gonna save him. See him? Don't bite me. We're saving a baby shark. Baby shark, dun 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 dun. Baby shark. Don't you bite me. Got bit by a crab tonight. Let's go a little deeper. I think he's good. You little, come on, man. Go home to your mom. All right, he's flowing back here. This is not the intended use of the honey badger. Come on, dude, I'm trying to help you. <sighs> See, there was a reason that I had to keep hunting. Let's put the detector down over here. I see you threshing around. You're gonna be okay, we're committed to this. You gotta swim that way though. I see you, go, go swim. There he goes. Baby shark, da -da 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 -da. baby shark. I think he's good. I saw him flip away. Not on the beach. Don't bite anybody. You remember that, us humans are cool. Some more than others. I think he's good. I can't wait to show my kids that. I, sh I saved the baby shark, yo. Yeah. We did it. Everybody. Dun, 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 baby shark. Dun, 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 baby shark. Dun, 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 dun. Don't lose the uh, dais. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. I saved a baby shark. It's going on my resume. It is most definitely going on my resume. Educator, metal detectorist, father, baby shark saver. That sounds good. We planned that into the honey badger, by the way. It, it's, it, we tested it for shark saving. This was once part of a key. 
That means I unlocked a quarter of a cheesecake. Nice little signal here. That is a greenie right there. I'm telling you, those are cues. Look a little bit closer in the area. We already know we're in a patch. We're also looking out for Baby Shark, make sure he didn't make his way back into the water, but I saw him swim away. Something deep. That's why we got the honey badger. This is deep. That's a crater, man. Hear how that signal changes as you get closer? That's iron. If it was a non-ferrous signal, it would uh, get stronger as you get closer. That's a signal. Finally a patch. See, you gotta be persistent.
can't wait to see how many steps I have today. This actually could be iron, but let's dig. thickens this has been here for a long time look at that green look at that green and that was deep but we know already we're in a good area fishing weights baby sharks they're all pushing in Sixty-five likes. I don't think I've ever gotten 200 while the stream was still on. Maybe once. If you're so inspired. I think we got it. We got it. I bet it's another fishing weight. Oh, would you look at this? Oh, that jerk. What? What is this? Gregory, what with? What? Oh, dude, thank you so much. That's going straight to the, uh, that's going straight to the legend. I'm gonna purchase that tomorrow, thanks to you. So, thank you. This kind of looks like a bottle cap. But I don't think it is. I was gonna say the shark bit it right here. It's a heavy. Yeah, Greg the Eggman, I, I don't think I've ever gotten that from anybody. So, really, thank you. You totally didn't have to. That's getting reinvested. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Next legend you will see. Uh, yeah, you can see me post tomorrow that I'm getting a legend. You just put it over top. Thank you. Uh, I bought it already, as you know, but I sent it down. So. Thank you. Thank you. I gotta swing really slowly and concentrate. I was just talking about like 20 minutes ago, there's no need to grid the beach. Now there's a need to grid the beach. But it all starts with spiraling out.
hatches are not done until you walk through them again. See? Fifty-eight, another mid-tone. Oh, what is this? It's a fish, we got a fish. Epic. Oh my God, Meryl saved the shark. Did you know in one of my live streams, Adele com comes by with a dead shark? She's a shark hunter. I found Nemo. Okay. Go, go, go. See, it's deep, but it's here. And that's also why you turn when you swing, because you saw how that turned into nothing. That was gonna be iron. lightning out in the distance. Yeah, we got some uh, lightning happening. Skipping that, that's going to be something big. Well, the lightning's not going up. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, we got some lightning. We got to move. See how that shortens up? Supposedly that surface. This is gonna be iron. Why am I digging this? Meryl, why are you digging this? No, don't dig that. What are you thinking? Adele, I saved the shark. I spoke to Adele, and uh, next year, game plan is England. 
England 2023. Patch might be exhausted. We're going to walk through again, though. Thank you for the 179 likes. I can't give this up easily because there's just too many good signals. I, I, I don't mean like good signals as in coming from the ground, I mean signs. Indicators. That was the dumbest thing to stick my hand in there. Okay, hold on. That could have gotten my hand. I am lucky, lucky, lucky. Ooh. Whew. 
great. Man. I would have been a trip to the emergency room for stitches right there. Don't do what you just saw me do, kids. Well, that's a good signal. Somebody blocked this crypto guy. Look at this. Look at this. Here we go. We just got something awesome. What in the world is this? I see the moon. Wow. Cufflink, nice. Who wears a moon cufflink? That's like, this is Harry Potter. Harry Potter and Lucky Charms. Nice signal here. Come on, give me a ring. Give me a ring. I mean, I'm happy. Don't get me wrong, I'm happy. Are getting stranger and stranger. Go, go, go. We got cufflinks and pins and stuff like that flying in. That's a good signal. That's a good signal. Come on. Dig like a honey badger, yo. There's a ring in here somewhere. I know that there is. Up, whatever this is. I don't mean in this scoop, I mean at this beach. Look at all this weird stuff. What in the world is this?
There we go. What is it? I don't know. Whatever it is, it's old. These are the conditions that you get like these old rings. Am I tired? Heck yeah. Yep, look at this. Green. The dais is doing a great job of separating. There's a bed of iron underneath. Four fifty-five. Is this it? Is this it? Go. Go. Got it. Where are you? Where are you at? Where are you at? Another nickel. Go, go, go. Garden Magic, thank you so much. Thank you so much. That's also going towards the legend.
This is on a bed of iron. This is the best I've seen the day is separate. Deep 90. It's a quarter. It's a greeny. Go. I'm digging tonight. Sixty one, go. Good signal, that's a good, good, good signal. 60, 61. Crater. Got it, go. Come on. Greeny, oh man, go, go, go. Hey, look at how deep that was. And we got a 90 right next to it. Where was this my first time down the beach? Uh-oh. Oh, Budweiser. You know, it's a pendant. Oh, boar's head? I thought it said Budweiser. Where's a boar's head pendant? Really? Boar's head? I'm a piece of meat. Really? Really? 
That unlocked the sandwich for me. Another signal right here. Greeny. Go, go, go. Deep. This is going to be work. Could be iron too. This is a zinkin. Of course it's a zinkin. Go, go, go. This wire, if you don't plug it in, to your bag, not plug it in. If you don't strap it in, the dais will read it. Greeny. Man. I'm happy with what I got. Don't get me wrong. You know how I feel about rings. These are the perfect conditions to get rings and old ones.
it would bother me if I leave the beach. There we go. Without exhausting possibilities. That big signal was iron. zinc. I have gotten gold on zinc signals. Many times. Not only gold, but good stuff. History, you name it. You know why I need a new pin pointer? This still follows the rule of the uh, the rules of the AT Pro. Goes underwater. Everything's a darn signal. Oh, Garrett! It's like a cave to the underworld. Oh, here. Apparently, we put it right there. There we go, we got George Washington. He was in a cave in the underworld. <laughs>
8788. I've had good luck. With those numbers. Oh hell, I'm calling ring. I'm calling ring. Let's see if I know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about. What is this? Oh, these are nice to have. These are uh, can openers, although this one is pretty broken. Bottle openers, you know, not can openers. I'm like punch drunk right now. Go, go, go. This was a 97. 95.97. Remember, this machine has the funkiest target ID. Now it's down to 92. It's going to be a quarter. It's on its side now. Got it. It's a quarter. Go, go, go. God, this seaweed is giving me OCD. There we go. That entire patch happened at the same latitude on the beach. That's what happens when you find the right latitude. Hey, we got 200. Thank you.
I could only recall that happening once before. And I'm not even sure if I recall that. I'm thankful. Mid-tone, here we go. I hear a little skip in there. on. Oh boy, this is running out of batteries. I'm not. Go. Oh. I saw a ring. Ah, I saw this on the side. Come on. Again, lots of mid tones. We got sinkers, we got green coins, old objects showing up. I did pull two rings this morning, by the way. <laughs> they were not special this morning. We got it. We got it. What in the world? Ah. Nickel. I thought it was going to be an older nickel. It's a greeny. This is perfect conditions. Just gotta keep going. Look at that.
That's the car that kicks you off the beach. Still hearing iron, it's still a part of the patch, you know? Seriously? A reflector? Really? Go, go, go. what it is Chinese coin these are really cool huh. 
Okay. Go, go, go. Car's moving. New York through the form has been tickling people. So if I see it come any closer, it's gotta go. But it could be construction going on. Meaning that those could be construction vehicles. golden color. Fishy, fishy thingy, thingy. That's what I'm talking about. I see it already. Nickel, man. Can be a bottle cap. The way it jumps around like that. But you never know, that's why I'm digging.
signals, man. I can't leave the beach. With signals like this, no way. This could be really good. I'm calling ring. <laughs> There's no way I know that. Watch well, it be a bottle cap. Rings you usually see by now. Nope. Beach debris. Thanks for the 210 likes. We're already in record territory. Behold, <laughs> I have found a key. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Bottom line is you cannot leave a beach with mid-tones like this. If it gets quiet for a little bit, sure. We've had a constant stream of mid-tones. I think I'm easily at 25,000 steps today. One of the rings that I got today, this morning, it used up all of my luck. It was in the dry. I 
remember commenting on this early in the video. There's that wire sticking out of the ground. And I stayed south of that. So look at that. These two are like petrified together. Man, we're getting everything except the ring. Uh-oh, did we? Oh, darn it. God, I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy. I just thought we had a ring though. That would have been icing on the cake.
You know, if somebody asked me to describe this live stream, I don't know what I would say. That's a lighter right there. Um, let's see, we saved a baby shark. Found some old funky stuff, cufflinks and all that jazz. The conditions were perfect. We're close, but I want my cigar. Hey, if you're new here, do me a big favor, hit that subscribe button. Helps my channel grow. There's nothing to make me happier than to do crazy streams like this every night. Go back and you compare this with my um, Mind Lab Equinox live streams, much faster swim. Deus has faster swing. I'm getting freaking dive bombed by birds now. I gotta move because these birds are not happy. I already faced the shark. I already faced the crab. Now these stupid birds. I believe we're out of the patch. I'm 
still in Birdville. Let's go. All right, dude, leave me alone. Bird man. Who has somebody Google this fast? Who's got better sight? Birds or humans? You can hear these clumsy things that are coming by though. Oh boy. This was a lot of fun though. Only thing missing was a ring, but oh well. All right, as soon as I get out of Birdville, I'm gonna stop for a few minutes, answer some questions, say thank you. Birds are morons. Hang out with my dogs. Shut up. You're your mother. They're like swarming. Leave me alone. Oh. I don't care. You could swarm me. I'm digging this. Oh my God, look at that. There we go. You hear them yelling at me? It's like Adele. Yeah, 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 I won, I won, I won. Got an engraving right here. Ah, uh, no, it doesn't. Or maybe it does. Right there. Oh, here we go. Hold on. Right up there. See, is that nine two five? Nine two five. Nine two five. See it right up in here? Boom shakalaka. There we go. You see, in life, you gotta compromise. I wanted a ring ring, but we got an earring. There we go. That's all thanks to the birds. And the sharks. And the crabs. And I find myself walking right back down to the beach. No, Meryl. No. We're gonna call that mission accomplished. Actually, it's not mission accomplished till I find myself way my way back to the car. 
because I could get jumped by some stupid birds. Yeah, you know, let's do that. Let's walk back to the car and we'll do a wrap up. I know you guys are scared when I say wrap. Um, yeah, I mean like, look at the fines, you know. Mission accomplished. Thanks, Keith. All in the day's work, save sharks, avoid birds, get bitten by crabs. Life is good, man. Shut up. Those things are batting practice. And they're swarming. I just saw a baby, shit. Well, we keep walking now. Don't plant your babies there, come on. You know the rules. like Game of Thrones where she does like the walk of shame. That's how I feel right now. Shame! Yeah, I got an earring. Five minute walk back to my car. Oh, I see a fence. That's a good sign. I see the blue path over there. And there should be another one over here. Oh, it's a baby tree. It's a baby everything tonight. I see the path. Is it cheesy if I say detecting's a metaphor for life? Yet just keep digging. <laughs> That's the secret. It really is. Smile and dig. Okie dokie. Here is the blue path. Do, 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 do. That was the Zelda sound effect. For all of you late 80s gamers. I'm honored. We still got a hundred in here. Yeah, let's do a good wrap up for you.
We on for three hours yet? Maybe. Bird Beach. Almost there, I see my car. are still yelling at me. When I get home, my dogs are going to yell at me. Tell you what, you waited this long. Let me put this down for one second. The camera, I mean. Uh, I need to use the restroom. Hold on. We'll be right back. We're back. Fastest restroom trip ever. And if you think I went to the actual restroom, it's locked. Okay. Go, go, go. Nature has restrooms. All right, we got a garbage pill right here. So, we'll do the wrap up right here. Dump this. Oh man, these old bones. All right. Well, that was a full night, wasn't it? Okay, first, we got somebody's cell phone. We got can opener. Whatever the hell this is. Yunk. Yunk. A reflector. I got a reflector. You know, I was actually considering holding on to the reflector. No, Meryl, no, don't. All right, we're gonna put the earring over here. Copper pipe, I'll save that for Adele. Got a cap of some sort. Shark bit that. Junk. A boar's head medallion. Like, really? Really? Who's gonna wear this? Makes you feel like a piece of meat. Okay. Uh, Yurink. Fishing weight. Man, I'm telling you, this is the sign right here. This has been there forever. Um, another fishing weight. 
or lore or whatever thingy. It's going garbage. Fishy, fishy, thingy, thingy. Uh, bottle opener. God knows I need to drink more. Um, yunk. Space peanut. Yunk. We'll get into the good stuff. Anytime you see coins this green, you keep digging. It didn't quite work out for me tonight. This thing almost stabbed me. Note to self, don't stab yourself on the way out. That would be counterproductive. We just separated these two keys. Unlocked cheesecake. We're gonna throw them out. Um, fishing thingy. Yeah, we're gonna throw that out too. This is old. I think what this, uh, it just broke. What this did was this held up the mouse's flagpole. That's what it did. The mice would put this into the ground and they'd put a flagpole or a liberty pole. Yeah. Liberty poles are coming back into style. Not really. Me attempting to be funny when I'm pretty tired. Okay, bunch of coins. Let's see. Phone earring. Oh, where's that cuff link? That was the other thing. <clears throat> Here it is. This was the other really nifty thingamabob. There we go. It's the moon. And the fish, can't forget about the fish. I'm delirious. Mouse's flagpole and all that fun stuff. This was fun though. All right, got my garbage pile over there. What is this? cap this was real folks this was real let me get a eight of you you guys are the best man hold on let's put this down here shine the light this little light of mine oh geez nobody wants to see me in strong light hi <laughs> Did he find that cell phone? Yeah, we found that cell phone early on. Yeah, and I looked at the light and now right in the middle of your comments, uh, there's like this big blur. Oh, <laughs> uh, there was a troll. I always have a troll. It's okay. Even before I YouTubed, I had a troll. It's all good. Thank you, John. Should I ground balance the wet sand or soft sand? Uh, the wet sand, I think. Best thing was saving that baby shark. Da -da 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 -da. <laughs> fun night. This was a fun night. We are almost on for three hours. That's insane. Yeah. Yeah, my idea of a good time right there. But anyway, I know some of you are up way past your bedtime. Um, yeah, I sincerely thank you guys for uh, watching tonight. Um, I, I, I had I had a really good time. 
So, anywho, yeah, this light is throwing me off. All right, folks. Everybody have a great night. Thank you so much for uh, hanging out, and uh, we will do it again.